Hello everyone. I'd like to discuss an add-in that I've discovered recently for Revit. It is available on um, trial and you can get at it through the Autodesk store. On your Revit interface you'll find there's a little shopping trolley up on the right of the screen there. If you click on the shopping trolley it will take you to the um, App Store and over here is where you can search for applications or, or add-ins that you can install. Just make sure that you signed in to be able to download this and then search for CADS or, or, or CAD and then rebar. And there we can see the CAD rebar extensions for Revit 2021. You might remember some time back Revit came out with these tools and then they removed them. They called them the extensions. And this is where you can find them again. This is where you can use the same sort of functionality. For those of you that don't know about it, um, if you select an element like a footing, if you had to work natively within Revit, you would have to create a section <coughs> and then place the rebar in the section individually using the rebar tools that Revit has available. And you'll find that over there. That's the typical way in which we usually go ahead choose the shape and place it in some other placement and then copy, move, constrain, whatever is necessary. With the rebar tools however, switching out into a wireframe mode so you can see what's happening, you just select the element, you have a look at the add-in, you look for the element, there's a spread footing, you select the tool and it then comes up with a macro where well, you can go and choose the settings for all the different rebar that you would like to use including the size, the hooks, etc. So there's for bottom bars, there's for top bars, there's dowels and stirrups. So the typical kind of reinforcement that you would like to add or rebar that you would like to add to that component. And it's as simple as choosing these parameters as you require and then selecting OK. Now you have to do this upon generation, you can't edit it afterwards. But it does allow one to quickly create rebar much faster than what we could do manually. Here I'm setting the view visibility states for the 3D view to show unobscured and as solid. If we switch out into a fine detail level, then even if we're in a shaded view we can see this. And just like that, the rebar is created. Very neat and very accurate. It's available for columns as well. Beams, continuous footings. There's a lot that you can do with this. I'm just selecting the defaults. You can obviously set this up just like you want based on your calculations. Generate the rebar. Let's have a look at what that looks like. Okay. A great way to save yourself some time. Beams. all the different settings you can place there. 
So if rebar is your area of expertise, do have a look at this add-in. I think it's a great time saver. So very quickly we can set up our rebar definitions within our file. Just remember though, that you need to do this upon generation, get it correct. If you find that no, it's not what you were looking for, you maybe made a mistake. Then you'd have to delete what was generated previously. And just generate it again. There we go. Go to our CADS rebar extensions and we generate this again. There's even a stirrup distribution where you can go to set different distributions based on the complementary shear. Additional top bars that you can add in and so on. So once you generate it, then that'll be available to you and it's generated all right okay so that's it really try it out see if it saves you some time definitely a tool worth considering even if it uh, becomes available for sale of course the amount of time that it saves you is well worth the investment if you do a lot of rebar just have a look in in general around the app store and see if you find some applications that can save you some time it's a typical sort of thing that we do in Revit we have a look every now and then and see is there an app that can help us generate components in Revit quickly till next time enjoy Revit